Turning now to the issue of masking in Northeast Wisconsin. As some counties and cities across the U.S. debate reissuing masking requirements, some locals are using their own judgment. NBC 26's Ben Boken has more. Life is about taking risks and also balancing those risks with some sort of safety. Wherever I am, I really try to wear a mask. To mask or not to mask? That's the question some are asking once again as COVID cases rise statewide. I'm trying to follow CDC guidelines. You can't beat science, especially good science. According to the DHS, Wisconsin's seven day average of confirmed coronavirus cases is at its highest level since May. And this weekend, Los Angeles County restored its indoor mask requirement. But locals like Tony Vicario never stopped wearing one. When you're indoors, wear a mask. So I've been doing that whether I'm at Costco or at Barnes & Noble. The CDC reports the COVID Delta variant is responsible for most new cases in the U.S. And statewide, the strain is now responsible for over 100 cases. It concerns Vicario, who wears his mask in almost every situation. After six, seven months, we've had both shots are starting to get sick again, and I really I'm trying to stay away from that. The Delta strain makes up nearly 2% of Northeast Wisconsin's variant cases. It doesn't worry Adam Stieber. The world's always going to change. What are you going to like cower in your home every time the flu seasons come around? Stieber says he only wears a face covering if a store requires it or when it makes someone feel comfortable. If I'm walking down the street, right, and there's no law that says I need to wear a mask, then I'm not going to wear a mask. He believes the Delta variant is important to track, but still Stieber prefers the choice to mask or not to mask. Let the Delta variant ravage a person's family and let that influence their decisions, not some agenda. In Green Bay, Ben Boken, NBC 26.